five, four, three, two, one. Hello. Hey, this is Science Camera Super Action. Action. She is Claudia. And he's Victor. Yes, and we are here at Metro Comics uh, San Patricio Plaza in Guaynabo, Puerto Rico, USA, baby. Yes. And we're going to talk to you about Moon, Moon Knight. Night. The very first episode of Moon Knight, which we saw last night on Disney Plus. What was your first reaction to this episode? It was brilliant. It's not the typical Marvel movie or Marvel TV yeah, series. It's, very it's like being a, it's like riding a roller coaster ride, like the worst you've ever been. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Well, it's something like the that. The one that pushes you around. Yeah, picks like gives you like 360. Puts you upside down. Yeah. <laughs> gives you 360 uh -huh. around, you know. Right, it, it is something like that. It is we it is weird, it is wild, it is brilliant, it is everything. It's a wild ride. <laughs> From the beginning, you know. Um, if you lose uh, one single detail of it, uh, you will lose it all. I mean, it's like it. From you better the, watch it. <laughs> yeah, from the uh, at first you see uh, the protagonist, uh, which is Os Oscar Isaac. You know, uh, apparently he has a uh, multiple sort of personality, mm -hmm. multiple personality disorder. His um, name is Stephen. Yeah, Stephen one of Brand. his one of his roles. Which he played very well, all of them. One of his roles is Stephen Grant, mm -hmm. which is the nice guy. He's a Pacific guy. Um, the I mean, he's a nice guy. He's the nice guy. He's a cute guy. There's the other, this other role. He plays another, the other role of Mark Spector, mm -hmm. which is a hands-on guy. Which is he. He's like a man, mercenary. Yeah, he's, uh, he, done he's for not hard. afraid of air, of anything. Although we haven't seen that aspect just yet, but yeah, yeah but we he's, saw he's, some uh, of he's it. A go like, yeah, he's like he's not afraid of anything, you know. Uh -huh. um, and then we see one of the face, one of the faces of Moon Knight, yes. which with the with the hood and cape, you know. Yeah. Um, uh, um, I would like to see the one with the tuxedo. It looks nice. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> Mr. Knight. That's uh, Mr. Knight. I think Os Oscar Isaac played all those three roles perfectly. He's really a very good actor. From first, you see, uh, you see him um, in one scene, or he's just walking around some place, and then he's he dozes off. Then when he opens his eyes, then something else happened. Even his blood in his hand, there people killed. I mean, yeah. he got into trouble. And he doesn't. He didn't. He doesn't know why. It was really, really wild. <laughs> really weird. The voices that he hears and he's the uh, the ones that he speaks to, um, is. It's very particular that he's talking to a statue that is sitting on a bench. It looks like in a park. Do you know who he is? Yeah, that's one. <laughs> that's Crawley. Well, in the comics, Crawley was a bum. He, he was haloed with flies, but he knew his way around the city, and he was always telling uh, Jake Lockley, one, the, one of, of the personalities of Moon Knight, the, the guy who, dro who drove the uh, taxi, uh, he gave him scoops and, uh, and information, inside information. There are big differences from the comic to the series. In the comic, originally, uh, Mark Spector was a mercenary that hasn't changed. But Stephen Grant was not a shopkeeper. He was a millionaire, a Bruce Wayne type. That has changed here. And um, because in the comics, uh, Moon Knight did not have a mo uh, dissociate dissociation. Multiple personalities. No, no, no. Yeah. I didn't come out right. Dissociation. <laughs> Dissociative. Ah, forget it. Multiple Let's say multiple personality disorder. Yeah. He just had secret identities. He had. That's in four. the comics, right? Yes, it was. Or he is. He's originally Mark Spector. Mm -hmm. Stephen Grant is one of his secret identities. So is Jake Lockley. So is Moon Knight. 
But after a while, in Marvel Comics, this comes from the comics, they decided, I, I think maybe because of Split, remember Split? Yeah, one of my favorite movies. They decided to give him this mental disease. And frankly, I'm not used to it. I know it. But, but it's, it was it's crazy. fun. This episode was a lot of fun. Yes. Because he, Steven, he plays Steven as very uh, insecure, very uh, clumsy. He's a nice guy. He's a nice guy, but he, he's very insecure. He, he doesn't dumb. know where his head yeah. is. And he has a problem. He, he, he can't sleep. He has to chain himself to a, to the bed because he doesn't want his body to be taken over by Mark Spectre, by the mercenary. And Mark is trying to save him. That's why there are situations in which Steven doesn't know where he is because his body has been taken over. Uh, uh, did we say spoiler alert? <laughs> this series, if you think that if you if you're like me who, who had never seen Oscar Isaac outside the, the recent Star Wars trilogy, X Men Apocalypse, and you thought that it was what he was as an actor, my God, was I mistaken? This guy has the acting chops. He, I mean, he was like a gymnast, like an Olympic type gymnast. Switching identities to and fro, switching, switching accents to and fro. It was wonderful. I mean, in the, in the very first episode, you're supposed to, to set up a situation, a problem, the protagonist, the protagonist, and the antagonist. But this is off the beaten path. This is totally different from Marvel. This is a great episode. I should mention that Miri Abraham, who had voices. Kanshu, the Egyptian god who gives Moon Knight his power. Wow. <laughs> it's very fun. You got highly recommended. This is highly recommended. I don't want to say anything else. This is great. And Ethan Hawke, you were supposed to talk about Actually, Ethan Hawke. Actually, yes. Uh, Ethan Hawke play a very interesting uh, character, yeah. which is Arthur Harrow. Harrow. Mm -hmm. ha Arthur Harrow. Um, he's like a personified judge, like a prophet or a cult leader. He's a Jim a Jones priest. type. Yeah, it was interesting. And more interesting is his tattoo, which oh. is a balance. I mean, uh, that balance, uh, every time he is in contact with another person, yes. that balance comes uh, alive, it comes, comes alive, alive. It, uh, starts moving and determines the fate of that person, the yeah. fate of, the that, fate person. of that person, yeah, it does. whether it's good or bad. But he, he's, I think there's some connection with, with, Egyptian, with God. Egyptian gods, Yeah. because Mark, I mean, not Mark, Stephen, has, is holding a scarab in his hand Yeah. and they're trying to get that scarab. And he's got he like, know why and, he has and, it and in his Ethan Hawke's character has a lot of people blind, following him blindly around. Some of them are armed, mm -hmm. and there's this this car chase that's crazy. Yeah, Just you better crazy. watch it. <laughs> yeah, it's great. Highly recommended. Well, we can't wait to watch the next episode. Yeah, episode two can come soon enough. Yes, well, highly recommended. This is light. Camera. Super action. action. See you next time.